Welcome back to uh, episode 5 of Let's Play Solid Snake. And we've got to make our way back now that we've caught the pigeon. Um, we're going to be making our way back to the first building. Now there's two ways you can do this. Um, you can go to the basement of this building and take the drainage ditch all the way back. But the drawback of that is um, for the rest of the game, until you get the medicine, Snake will have a cold. Or you can walk all the way back to the other. Oh, there's a hole there. Or you can walk all the way back to the other building. Um, I think the more fun thing to do in this situation will be to go to the drainage ditch. It'll make the game a little more interesting. Uh, card. So Mash uh, mentioned in the thread that uh, he thought it was pretty ridiculous that Snake would be hunting a pigeon. Um, it's going to get more ridiculous. I'm not trying to spoil anything, and I won't, but, um, while I'm waiting for this elevator, I mean, this reminds me of Mass Effect in 2D, the first one where you had to sit in the elevators. Um, it gets a lot, a lot more ridiculous. But, um, I just finished a nice shift where, um, I worked by myself for about two hours, two and a half hours, and it's a, uh, it's, there's some holiday or something coming up, um, well, let's get my gun out so we can shoot these guys, um, Easter or something's coming up, and, uh, been busy, you know, I don't know, people are buying shit, I, I, I will have to say that I think people noticed that I was there by myself, and they were very, um, elevator, uh, I think it's this one. They were very um, understanding, so that was a plus at least. Yep, this one. Pew, B1. Loading screens, remember those? Alright. Oh shit, the mines! Oh, I think those will kill me. I shoot them? Yep, thank god. Can I go up here without... nope. Alright, here we go. Whee! Down the drainage ditch. Okay. And now we're back in the... oh shit. Go up. Is there anything up here? If Hideo Kojima rules apply, there will be nothing up here and I'll have wasted a trip. Let's see, what this, let's see what information this little boy has to tell me. Come here. The water in the ditch is freezing. You can't get cold if you stay in too long. Yeah. Too long being at all. So we're going to go. There we go. No? You would think I would have figured out now which... There we go. Card four. Cool. Is there actually anything down here? Bullcrap. Let's go up here. Landmines. Landmines. What's in here? Oh yeah, the trash compactor. Okay, now I know where I'm at. Despite having played through this game, I think four or five times, um, you know, still get lost from time to time. I'm not a professional. I just play one on TV. And it always makes me giggle. It makes snakes spin in place like that. Alright. What was B1? I don't think this is it. Nope. I need to go up another floor. So, she told us... Um, Petridge told us to look for her... Because all the soldiers in the complex are male and she's a female. So we just need to keep an eye out for uh, uh, this one. We just need to keep an eye out for a woman. And we should look for her in the one place that a woman would go, which is the bathroom. So you don't get to have the fun little misadventures where you can put C4 on somebody's back and blow them up and then uh, grab Meryl and snap her neck and then just be like, oh... Snake, what are you doing? 
Kill my daughter. I mean, uh, my niece. That's later. Alright, so... This is my favorite music, by the way, in the whole game. I don't know if you'll actually hear it when I actually edit it, but, uh... It's like the sad, like, there's shit going down, but you don't know about it yet. And this is my favorite item in the game, the mouse. Now, what the mouse does is, if you make a noise and you alert a guard, he will, and you release the mouse, he'll go, Oh, shit. He'll just go, oh, it's just a mouse, and then he'll move on. Uh, this is our reset room, I think. Yep. And I call it a reset room because if you go in that room, there's not shit in here, I bet. Oh, landmines I don't need. All right, and I'm going to get spotted. Yep. Um, I call it the reset room is because if you go in here while you're under alert phase, it automatically resets because there's a little girl in here. What does she say? I hate people with blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah. Fuck. Go reset again. Highly skilled player. Snow little snake. And uh, for you, those of you who don't follow me on Twitter, I think, like, two of you. Um, ooh, remote control missile I don't need. Um, they actually have a copy of this game in the MSX cartridge form. It was, like, unopened and perfect, pristine, ooh, ration. That, uh, was, like, $400. I was like, no, 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 no. Oh, wait, we gotta go up here. I think. Mm, I think it's down. Eh, fuck it, we'll go this way. Fuck it. Fuck a pit trap. Now, what was he doing there? I'm looking at the wall. I got it. Alright, is there anything under this table? Nope, just a snake. Oh, oh, oh. More mice, I don't need. I mean, they give you, a, like, the remote control missiles in this game. Um, they don't really do anything. In the original Metal Gear, they would blow up um, heat panels, but in this one, they really don't do anything. Alright. Now that we've got our shopping done, I think. I might even be in the wrong area. Hmm. I know that's okay. Go up one more floor. Should be this one. Maybe. We'll see. Doesn't matter. What else are you gonna do? Hmm? Spend time with your family during the Christmas season? Oh yeah, we're in the right place now. Uh, I need card four. Don't you run. Mm. Mm. Fucking highly sensitive equipment. Alright. Let's explore. What's in here? Little kid. Grown-ups always stand attention when they hear the national anthem is one of the rules. National anthem fucking Zanzibar land awesome. We got big boss on our side. Nope, don't have the card for that. I don't I know I don't have the card for that, it's just a kid anyway. Keep going, oh shit, I'm gonna get spotted. Punch, punch. Really? Just gonna keep throwing guys at me? Alright, hold on, I'll get my gun out. And I pull out my gun. And hide, cause they'll spot you. Hell shit bubbles. Please don't come down here. I see you're coming down here anyway, and I'll punch you to death. Right, that's the end of that. And that silliness. <laughs> oh, okay, I know why I can't get up there. Run, 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 snake. Yeah. They don't ever give you enough room on the screen most of the time to get away before you set off the alert again. Huh. Uh huh. 
Uh -huh. Oh, wait, 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 I know. I've got it now. I should really make post-its. Cheez-its. Mmm, Cheez-its. Gotta go around here, there's a fucking camera. What was that noise? I want to say, as a Metal Gear fan, that that, uh, Metal Gear Rising, that looks pretty awful. Like, I'm still going to buy it because I'm a whore, but, mm -mm. little girl, what do you want? There's only one bathroom here. I'm too scared to go there at night. People touch me. All right. I think there's a pit trap in that room with that little boy. You can stay in here, Billy, and, uh, oh, fuck. <sighs> I didn't get the night vision goggles. This may kill me. There's a bunch of soldier mannequins in there. Alright, so where's the door? Right here? Hey. This is a little hard. Go. I forgot the night vision goggles. Uh, that's a real soldier. Like, stand there, Bill, but don't tell anybody, because you know, you just give yourself away. Oh, fuck. I got these three soldiers. Oh, snake. Now we're in the kitchen. Um. And if you go in here, there's a freezer. Frozen rations. So we've already run into a freezer. Oh, shit. Nah, run into the freezer. Don't ever find you. There we go. And for some reason, after you cancel the alert, they just disappear. All right, now you have the men's room and the women's room, so we're going to take a squat right here. And we're just going to wait, like some pervert, while I grab this Coca-Cola. And, uh... Yeah. I got. I guess I lucked out in the uh, trench because I didn't get a cold. Usually I do, and like the whole time you're walking around, you, you just see snake going. Chia. So is this a guy or a girl? Hmm. Thinking about it. Might have to tinkle. Don't really have to go to the bathroom. Okay, I lucked out first time. Sometimes you'll get a guy, he'll just go in there. And I follow her in the bathroom, Snake. What's up? Gustava. And now we go into first, first person view. I'm Gustava Hefner of the STB. You must be Solid Snake. We're after the same thing. Why don't we work together and save Dr. Mar? Cool. Have we met someone before? Hmm, typical Western male. Always ready to feed the pick up line. Your gusto, blah blah blah. No one cares. So, as a little part of his backstory, Solid Snake likes figure skating, which is just weird. All right, then we have enough of this. What about Dr. Marv? I make contact, save good, and now you get blah blah blah. They're probably like, My name's Gustavo, I'm Marv. I like cheese. What about you? It's pretty good, mostly cheddar. Blah blah blah. No one cares. Snake, Dr. Marv is safe for now. He's in a large crevice of no man prison by their son. Uh, concerned Dr. Madnar, don't worry, Madnar is safe. I know a shortcut to the crevasse. There's an old sewer. You can take that elevator down. Let's go. Whoa, there's an elevator there? What do you know? So, I guess in Zanzibar land, the priority was there's female restrooms for no female soldiers. And you put an elevator in there. 
And just because you have Snake go, oh, there's an elevator in here, doesn't mean it's any less retarded. Mm. Spoiler. So here we go. And now we're in, like, Dragon Warrior mode where she follows me around. And, you know, if I've only played it when it was called Dragon Warrior, it doesn't make you any cooler to call it Dragon Quest, okay? I've only played Dragon Warrior 1 and 2. It's not like I'm going to say, oh, Dragon Quest, you mean, right? It's like when I say Final Fantasy 2. I mean Final Fantasy 2 that came out on Super Nintendo. I don't mean that. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That bulldozer almost got my ass right out of the gate. Go, go right. Okay. Those things will... Ooh. See, she can cheat. There is a stuff on the ground. And when she's with you, you can't crouch anymore. For some reason. Let's wait for that to go back and then we'll just go. She's a little too close for snake comfort. Yeah. All right, go, 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 go. Oh, 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 oh. tag me. Fair enough. Even the best die sometimes. All right. Round two, motherfuckers. Run. I don't really need ammo. Ooh, the trap almost made me pee a little. Alright. So these things are the machines that clean sands of Barland sewers. It's just... Like, all this shit you gotta think about. Like, hey, big boss, make sure you get them sewer cleaners. Run, 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 run. Oh, shit, gotta go to the left. Oh, is this thing gonna kill me or is it gonna stop? Phew. Snake, why are we going in circle? Hey, hey! Madnar! Doctor, you're alright! You lost some weight, Madnar. You haven't changed a bit, Snake. Do you still kiss as good as you used to? Ah, oh, Dr. Marv is waiting. You mean Marv is still alive? Blah, blah. You and the doctor get behind me. I have something to give you. It's a kiss. And now we've got our, our wizard in our party. And he always stays like two feet back and barely walks. So, can you go up? Nope. So the retarded thing is like... Madnar had an elevator in his thing the whole time, but he just couldn't get out. You know, it's like he wasn't even trying. But you know, pry that shit open, go down the... You know, you just don't really want to escape. That's what it is. And when you got, a uh, When you got Tella with you, he, uh... He doesn't. He, the things just disappear. They don't have to worry about them hitting you. So then we go down. Wait, I caught him. I must rest a little. Snake? Alright, we'll take a break. Please excuse me. I have some business to take care of. He has to pee pee. He has to make tinkle water. Snake using his crouching animation. They actually went out of their way and did uh, Gustavo's animation so she's sitting down. In the yellow stuff. Oh man, I can't hold like he used to. Cutscenes are fun to me. <sighs> Special agent, fate can be funny. As a little girl, my mother used to tell me stories, and then she beat me by Poland. Nazis, you always gotta fucking bring that up. Cake with her, can I even see her face? I think Olympic medals would get to the. Yeah. <laughs> the ice felt cool. Snake, are you married? I'm all alone. Who had a boyfriend once? Frank Hunter. Blah, blah, blah. West projected, no one cares. I've even killed a man. Our Berlin Wall was too high for us to climb. Like, you know, when you write a line like that, you just think that it's the cool, you're like, oh yeah, it was a great line. Try to keep you waiting. Uh, that was some bathroom break. You take a shit. Let's go to Snake. 
I gotta quit my 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 rations. So because I'm a good player and I have not gotten the mind detector or the night vision goggles, this next sequence will be really fun. Elevator, take the tire snake. No, oh, you can't. Elevator. There we go. Cause like usually, you could just lay down and just climb through the field. But uh, not this time. Let's see. Alright. Uh, I think there's. Keep going, keep going. I think we're good. We're good, we're good. Alright, we're good. <laughs> A bridge! Exclamation boards! Only cross one at a time. That's a shitty bridge, then. We go first. I haven't got long to live anyway. No one miss me if I fall. Yeah, but if you fell, we would still make it across the bridge. He looks back one last time. Snake, I miss you. Miss you most of all. It's alright. You can come across. Okay, I'll go next. See you on the other side. Like it's some big epic thing. Safe snake ring cross over. Miss old. Gustavo. Gustavo, snake. Take control of your life and start living. He's dying. My bruise to you. How do I use it? Eh. The snake begins his long tradition of listening to people die. Snake. And they drag him away. And we get the Star Wars S cutscene and some robot penis. Metal Gear. All right. Only five episodes in. We've already got our first e glimpse of the Metal Gear. Snake, it's me, Gray Fox. Gray Fox. Bridge is closed. I'm taking Madner with me. Tell you what, Snake, full time Snake, blah, blah, blah. Sorry, Carcass, out of here. Take it over, Snake. Ah, ah, ah. Fox, you won't get rid of me that easily. And, like, he just leave her body there. Just, uh, this is how we mourn. Who's calling me? Holly, Snake, you remember the run in the tower building they used for parachute jump training? No. If you hang a hang glider, you can jump straight over. There should be a hang glider on the east side. I saw it one thing, it's Thanksgiving. See ya. We were jumping off getting high, it was great. So, landmines. Oh, yeah, more mines. I needed them. Alright. Cha cha cha. Now I'm back in the other building. Uh, can I get in this door over here yet? And we also have the brooch, the Gustavus brooch. Um, you can use it to unlock a couple of lockers, but um, I think that after I get out of this fucking situation, let's just get out of here. Card six. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I know you see me. It's cool. I think that will do it for this episode. Uh, next time. We'll try to fight a boss. Try not to have so much storyline next time. Uh, thanks for watching, and see you next time.